a first uh, Thursday night seminar ever, and interesting origin story. So I've been following a lot of the online discussions about streaming and gear. You know, I like to read about all the audiovisual gear. And at the end of one post and one thread, Levy said something like, I've got half a mind to do a seminar about how to give proper commentary for streaming pinball. And I had half a mind to have a seminar about streaming pinball. So we took our two half a minds and put them together, and we got one mind, and here we are. Levy, take it away. All right, thank you for joining us at the first ever Thursday night Pintastic seminar. I hope you're as excited. Calm down, calm down, calm down. All right, for this uh, seminar, we are going to, we are going to uh, simulate an actual stream of an actual high-level pinball tournament. So with no further ado, let's introduce our competitors tonight. And I don't want to get anybody too excited, but they are playing for three American dollars. This match has stakes, $3.00. Tax-free, we'll go to the winner. We're not going to tell anybody. And uh, all right, let's get started. Our first competitor, one of the greatest New England pinball players of all time, famous beyond compare, the former owner of Flat Top Johnny's. Let's hear it for the former multiple New England champion of the world, Mitch Curtis. Thank you, Levy. Thank you. You're welcome. Please, please don't talk to me. And his opponent, some scrub I've never heard of before, the current New England champion of the world, B -b 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 Bowen Carries! And Bowen will be leading off on Attack from Mars, a great game to stream. You know it, you love it, you know the rules. Shoot the lock thingy for locks, start the multi ball, open the space shield, space shield dealy. Uh, but enough yakking. Let's see some hot pinball action. And uh, please welcome my co-host, Jade Ang, who will be yeah. commenting this game with us. One. Two. I will have to owe you the... No, it's three. All right. All right. All right. It's Attack from Mars. You know it, you love it. Are we going to see someone rule the universe today? I'm not sure. With, with this caliber player, you're just hoping for a multi ball game. Right. Oh, nice little trap catch. Oh, misses his first shot. Is that a bad omen for this match? Misses his second shot. Uh, misses his third shot. It's a B for Rama. Uh oh. All right, under control. We're good. We were nice orbit Bobby shot. Blaster. Yeah, we can hear the players, too. It's distracting. Ah, still getting the handle on that kick out. You're looking for a beautiful drop catch out of that kid. Right, right. Uh, now, hitting all those shots and all four shots will get his total annihilation multi-ball. Looks like he's getting an early start on that. Inflates his lobster. Oh, boy. That's trouble. Get your hands off me! Almost as if he's played this one before. Oh, he's in Sling Town. That's a bad place to be. Oh, very Lovely nice drop catch. catch. Oh, I don't know what he's going for there. Maybe trying to get that, uh, maybe trying to get his shield open? Oh. Looks like we're going full total annihilation here under this strategy. Yeah, it's off to a very nice early start. Oh, slink. Oh boy. Uh oh. Uh, yeah, this table's set pretty tight. Uh, survives another inland. Are the gods of one dollar bills smiling on Bowen Karen's tonight? You know, this is a game that does punish you for missed shots, and so far it's not. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh. You talked it up. You talked Got it up. Got a little cute there and paid the price. <laughs> All right. Here comes the former New England champion. Mitch Curtis. All right, that was a very nice first ball by Bone Karens. He got a bunch of his total annihilation shots done. 
Um, wow. Oh, goes for the super, uh, goes for the skill shot to open. Oh! Uh, oh, and he survives. You know, Jay, that's why I never do that. I don't like to uh, risk losing it off the skip, but he did open it, and he did get his ball back. Oh, he looked out. Attacking oh. the center. Yeah, you know, oh, oh, and he paid for it. Oh. Wow. All right. All right, uh, that was a relatively quick ball, but... Yeah, he did get his uh, saucer open, and if that's and if he's and if he's playing all saucer, I guess you know that's what he wants to do. And, uh, oh wow! We're now it's, now Bowen's going for Super Skill Show. A little copycat action. You know, it is a copycat lead. Competitive. Wow! Don't look now, but he's what? Green Martian. Four shots away from his own eyes. Five shots. Six shots. Anywhere from three to six. All right, trying to get control of the ball here. He's sling land. His uh, Martian attack is lit. Let's see if he tries to bring that in. <laughs> it's, it's just something. He hasn't hit anything in a while, so. Yeah, he's, <laughs> but you know, it's. Oh, God. Oh, oh so close. Attack oh. oh, and he tilted. Attack from beef. And uh, he drains out the right outlet. Uh, I'm going to leave a timer for two minutes. Seven, 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 uh, three. Mitch is going to await this one out. Now, I thought we were going to maybe, in between balls, do some seminar talk. But these, these balls have not been as lengthy as I was expecting. <laughs> uh, let's see if Mitch can get something going here. Pretty even uh, game so far. But it's really going to come down to, uh-oh. Uh, nice little Oh, it gets there. his lock with the first person to do that in this game. And attacks, gets his second consecutive, get lights the a lot. What do you think his strategy now is just get his multi-ball going with his uh, saucer open, perhaps? Wow. Or just make any shots, really. <laughs> he might be aiming for the post, Jay. Oh, I mean, right with these, the oh. I mean, with these scores, you just want to get whatever you can get, so. Well, they are playing for three American dollars. Very nice. nice. That's two locks. Okay. Looks like he's going straight for it. Is he going to try to maybe jump this over? About to find or out. is he going to take out another annihilation shot? Oh. Pops it oh. over. All right. See if he can survive the kick out. Oh! Awarded the multi ball. Beautiful. All right, the table's set. Let's see if he can start the picnic. <laughs> Boom, jackpot. Nice. Oh. He's got to get all jackpots and he can light the roving super jackpot. Uh, we Are those post jackpots? Thank God, they're still ball safe. We've wow. Still a chance here. Oh, and now he's out of ball safe. Boom! Jackpot! Boom! Jackpot! All right, he's got what? Three left now? Two. Right. He's got to shoot his right ramp and his left orbit. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh -oh. No. Uh, takes a couple dangers right. but survives. Just needs two more. And now he's got to play with his. Uh, Tips his fingers right now. It's too dangerous. Oh, great ball control there. Oh, oh nice drop catch, but fails on the follow-up. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> this really is the way it should always be. I think they should be able to hear the commentators. There it is. One more. If you can hit the right ramp. It's the toughest shot in the entire cycle, most would say. Boom! Nice. His super is lit on the left orbit. It's going to move. Super jackpot. Can he bring some more in? All right. Oh, He's Bowen Karen of... writhing, as you can see, his $3 oh. slipping away. And he is out of multi-ball. All right. He's out okay. of, is he going to get one for the road? No. Uh, but anytime right. you can complete it and get a super jackpot, you got to be happy with your multi-ball J deck. Well, he's sitting pretty at a billion points. And so he takes out the saucer. Nice. So he's crested the what? Billion five mark at this point? Yeah, he's built a pretty healthy lead right now. What about a bill? We've seen billion point leads evaporate pretty quickly on Attack from Mars before. Going back oh, to multi-ball, I think. I mean, I think the fiery New Englander strategy is starting to become clear here. Get every available man. He's going all multi-ball all the time. Okay, ramp. Multi-ball. Oh. oh, he's got that hurry up, though. He's, he's really going to chase that? And oh. he pays the price. Oh. 
You know, Jade, you see that sometimes. Players get distracted by the shiny object and it throws them off of their strategy. Oh, it seems to me like he would have done well to just keep shooting lock shots there. But, uh, That's what I thought he was going to do, but he wanted to go for the cheap shot there. Okay. He's playing and we're not, so who are we to question his... Uh... <laughs> All right, it's ball three. Bo and Karen's better get up to uh, something here, or it's going to be a walk-off win for uh, the Massachusetts baller, Mitch Curtis. He's a couple shots away from total annihilation, you know, but... You know, these remakes are infamous for the shots are a little off, the flippers are a little different. Maybe he's throwing off the veteran a little. Right. Oh, is he going to go for a, is he gonna go for a uh, billion point shot here? Is he going for it? Bone Karen's handing it up for the cameras. Is he going to get distracted by this Martian? No, I think he's going for it. If he can get, if he can, there it is. There's number two. The party has begun. He needs, oh, and he takes it in, but he gets a nice 300 million hurry up. Nobody. And he's he's only two shots away now from his total annihilation. Watch out, man. Uh -oh. got a two shots in that right ramp. Two shots, Bone Cat. And is skewing the uh, playing an opposite way from uh, from uh, Mitch. He's just skewing the multi ball and just going for his hurry ups and his hopefully total annihilation. Oh, he's going for Martian. I didn't see this. Oh, oh, no. oh he breaks wow. it in. His total annihilation to this Martian multi ball with two more shots. He used that his right Martian round. bomb right at the very end there. Oh, I did not see the Martian yeah, bomb. Yeah, the Martian bomb. The very smart play. Use it what's available to him, using what the game gives him. And now it's Mitch Curtis's turn to sweat. He just still needs that right ramp and he can start to annihilation. Oh, right ramp, see a hell of a boom out of Yeah! <laughs> Every shot lit for big, big points. Multiple, is he still in Martian by any chance? He's still getting Martian shots too. And he's taken the lead. A once secure lead has evaporated. Like the confidence of Mitch Curtis. Four balls in play, every, every shot is lit. Jim, this is top flight competitive pinball. I'm glad I'm here to witness this. Jackpots. He's down to two balls. Wow, look at that. Oh. And he gets the um, hitting that lock shot for the long shot. That'll give him a cumulative super jackpot. Oh, he's Great little a... drop that shot. Oh, rough saucer hit. And he drained that One for the road. And uh, nice. wow, he's uh, uh, what's he at about now? Two five? Two. Oh, wow. He's almost at three billion now. So, all right, three billion points now for uh, Bowen Karen. Still alive. He's getting some ramp combos. And again, completely skewing the multi ball, just going right back to his total annihilation. Competitive pinball is not about fun ball counts. Oh, wow. He survived that. All right. Now he's going for his multi ball. There we go. Trying there to put on a little show for the people. Get the troops ready. The troops are ready. Okay. You know, I have a feeling when Paul Revere made his famous ride, this is what he was thinking about. A future, a freedom, pinball, extreme excitement. Right. Oh boy, just one, one shot for multi ball. Can you do it? I was going back to total annihilation. It seems like he's finally gotten these, uh, gotten his shots dialed in after a fairly beefy ball one. But that's why pinball is three balls. He's trying to get control. There we go. Might as well work your way to another total annihilation if you're dialed in like he is right now. Yeah, he just seems Why to be not? taking what, what it's given him at this point. Oh, it tries uh, to backhand the... Uh, oh, there we go. Multi-ball. It's a multi-ball. It's a multi-ball. Multi-ball! Jackpot! More jackpots. Jackpots, that is a great thing. Wow. Kicking off jackpots like an old lady at a flea market. Look at this. Amazing. He's got only three left in a super jackpot. And he's out of ball save, so nice, jackpot. another one. Uh, his two orbit shots now, the only ones left to light a super. Those are be the easiest shots, too. 
All right, down to two ball play. Oh, he's trying to keep it alive. Nice. Oh, he's so close. He's a, now he's got the roving super jump. All right, it's lit for what, 250 mil, right? Is he gonna wait for it to come onto one of these orbits? No, he's just, he's just, the, the treasure box is open and he's, and he's, and he's going in. He's trying to keep his multi-ball alive. Right Well, that super jackpot's not going anywhere. Very so. nice drop catch. Oh, there it is! Oh, super oh, jackpot, 250 oh, billion! Oh, oh he's, he's got to be well over 5 billion in bonus now. Jackpot! A tilt would be costly at this point. I don't think he has any danger. Uh, still very lucrative. Oh, there's one for the road, and he relights the lock, which is very nice at the end of your multi-ball. That was nice. If one, two, he's locked. Lock and ball. Lock and every available man. Oh, just be okay. oh, progress towards TNA. Perhaps the three dollar pot has brought the level of play for this match higher. Watch out, man. They've got a big old beat. All right. Oh, that's dangerous. Oh, oh that's out. But it a good ball for Bowen Cairns. Let's hear it. That's why we're all here. All right, Mitch Curtis comes down to a drastically altered landscape, looking down the barrel of a four billion point deficit. Can he catch up? Can he show us what he's made of? Can he show us that he's New England, Boston strong? And uh, right, well, he gets well, his uh, thingy open. What is that called? Super skill shot of saucer is open. Going back in for another multi-ball. All right, all right. Multi-ball is way to victory. Eschewing the total annihilation strat. All in on the multi-ball strat. Oh boy, <laughs> I think he was trying to tip over, but didn't quite succeed. Oh, that saucer shot makes me real nervous. We must build an atomic blaster. Yeah, every time you go up there, you, you always wonder where it's going back. Oh boy. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Got a good award here. Oh, it's the most oh. exciting thing in pinball. It's a video mode. <laughs> All right, this is your basic sweep side to side. It's not too tough. And then you have your bomb. There's you a bomb, the right, hitting the uh, start button at this point. We'll extinguish all these advancing uh, spaceships. Wow. Oh, uh, you had to use it kind of early. You know what, this is actually more exciting than I thought it would be. Oh, and he takes, <laughs> he takes a spaceship right to the face. <laughs> 75 million out of a possible 650. He can't be too happy about that video mode. He's still got a wall to climb right now. Uh-oh, this is trouble. You think he'd go back to that multi, but there it is. Oh, there it is. All right, there going now, he's about, uh, and his next super jack, if he gets it lit, will be 500 million, not 250. Multiball. Chopping his way to victory. I see Bone Karen nervously chugging water in the background. Okay. That's one. Or, you know, just hit some posts. That's cool, too. Uh-oh, he's down uh, to two balls already. That's not good. Gotta. Oh, no. Flat oh, a little boy. bit here. Can he, can, can he regain control? Oh, that was very nice on the fly. The jackpot. The tough one. Another one. Right. What's that, two left or one? Two left. He's both, both ramps. ramps. Boom. Nice. Nails it. Jackpot. Boom. Oh, oh no, he checked. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't make it. Kisses the orbit. Oh no. All right, but uh, he's still got he's still got time now to get this super jacket. Yeah, they were five hundred million points, and he needs it bad if he wants that three dollars. Oh no. Can you do it? Uh, Boom! He got it. There it is with the wow. grace period five hundred million. Very nice. He's not giving up with a fight. He's not folding like a cheap suit. And he's going back to the multiplayer. Right. Will he get distracted again by the saucer, which caused his premature beef last time? Maybe he's learned his lesson. Oh, no. No, he, he has not. <laughs> <laughs> and he goes back to the spaceship. Oh, oh I think he wants his, uh, I think he wants his Martian. Oh, this is trouble. Oh, okay, all right. Bail takes he's the bailout shot in the orbit. I think that was smart. And he's getting close to his annihilation now, right, Jay? Oh, it was a good dig there. Very nice backhand flail to, to light the lock. Oh! oh! 
Oh. All right, let's hear it. That was a great game. <laughs> Bo and Karen's, come on down here. I want to award you the $3 and the title of first inaugural Thursday night seminar pinball fantastic champion. Good job. Let's hear it for both Mitch. Second place. Second place. Oh, hold on. It's coming up. Second place will win you a dollar. Thank you very much. Uh, let's hear it for Mitch and Bowen. Thank you very much. Um, that was pretty awesome. I don't think I've ever seen a display of competitive pinball so truly outrageous and awesome. All right, now we've entered the brief seminar portion of, of our uh, presentation. Um, we're going to discuss some do's and don'ts of pinball streaming. Um, first thing I want to do is just a disclaimer. Uh, you know, this is just kind of the way I like to do it. There's a lot of great people uh, doing this who all have their own style. And anybody who's willing to contribute to a pinball stream in any capacity is, is really doing God or whoever deity you worship in pinball's work to help further competitive pinball and streaming, and I appreciate it. Uh, that being said, I think the most important thing, and something you see overlooked a lot in these streams, is uh, a focus on the action. Uh, when people are watching this at home, they want you to watch what's going on in the game. They want you to pay attention. They want you to talk about it. They don't necessarily want to hear about what you had for lunch. Um, if you have that game at home and how nice it is, uh, what are some of the other ones? Um, how they did the last time they played it, how they got screwed the last time they played it. You won't believe it. I was playing this in uh, Pintastic seven years ago, and the ball just leaped over the flipper, bounced over the post, and then landed in the hole, and then it came right out in between the flippers. Like, nobody cares about that stuff. Focus on the action at hand. Um, that being said, there is always downtime in these games if you kind of want to beef around a little bit. Um, and if you're doing this for hours, I, I kind of like to do it only for a few hours at a time. You, you start to get a little punchy. Uh, but you will find the urge to kind of stray a bit, I think. And, you know, in between balls, in between games is maybe the time to, to, uh, address, uh, to let a little steam off, kind of do that kind of thing. But when the match is going on, you really should try to focus on it. You shouldn't, try to, you shouldn't get into any kind of story or anecdote that you're not going to be able to get out of uh, within 15 or 20 seconds. Um, and really just the most important thing is if something, and it, it, rules discussions is the same thing. Uh, people want to know the rules, but this is not a Bo and Karen style tutorial. It's a pinball stream. So um, I don't know if you saw what Jade and I were trying to do. Rules are good to talk about, but I think you really want to just kind of look at what's available to the player right now. Maybe not what's going to be available you know, six or seven achievements from now. Um, you want to talk about what they're doing, maybe not what you would be doing, um, and you want to you want to just kind of kind of keep the viewer engaged by letting them know what's happening in the game now, what kind of opportunity scoring wise uh, or feature wise is is maybe on the horizon, uh, and if they're not doing something you think they should, you can say it, but you don't want to again dwell on you know if I were playing I'd be doing this. Um, you might just say, you know, why is he not shooting that? Is, is there something else going on? Um, another thing is try to give your booth mates some space. Um, try to maybe bring them in. Uh, if uh, sometimes you get a lot of new newcomers in, yeah, feel free to ask them their opinion on, on what they think of a particular shot or something like that. Um, let me see what else I got for you. Uh, one more thing I think is important is situational awareness. Um, knowing what's going on in the game. You know, what are the scores? What does Mitch need right now? And that was very exciting. You know, Mitch was maybe one multi-ball away from really making a, a game out of that. It's good to, to let him know how far behind he is. Uh, if there's something he could do in a few shots, maybe to get him right back into the game, uh, I think that's worth talking about. Um, again, it's all about keeping the viewer engaged, uh, keeping everybody uh, updated on the stakes, um, and, you know, just kind of, uh, uh, you know, just kind of just, Make, making it about the, the actual game and the show. Um, and uh, yeah, I already discussed rule sets. Oh, one last thing is the chat. Uh, I know we all love the chat. Uh, I think you should avoid becoming over-engaged in the chat during a match. Um, you don't need to read every comment. You don't need to respond to every comment during an actual ball. Again, focus on the game is, uh, is, the, is the name of the game here. 
Well, the name of the game is pinball. The name of the streaming game is focusing on the game. Um, the chat is cool to engage in or dip in, but uh, keep in mind that a lot of the stuff in the chat will take care of itself. If somebody in the chat five minutes ago said, How, you know, what is the format of this tournament? Somebody else in the chat probably already answered them by the time you read it. Uh, I've been in booths before where somebody will maybe explain the intricacies of a double elimination bracket every four or five minutes. And that doesn't really need to be done. It'll, it'll, it'll happen on its own in the chat. Um, so, you know, I, but, but it is cool to answer stuff. Again, between balls, between games, that's the time for that stuff. All right, uh, we're going to bring down two more players. Uh, who here wants to play pinball? Anna Wolk, you want to play Attack from Mars? No, she doesn't. Uh, this guy. All right, this guy. Who's that? These two? All right, we got Mark. Mark from Parts Unknown. Oh, all right, it's Mark from Jerry. We got a pinball celebrity in the house. Yet another one. Oh, uh, no, I'll bring someone in. All right, so we got Mark, and then who's the other fella? All right. Oh, the Sonic Maker. This guy made his own pinball machine. That's cool. All right, we're going to have Marco first, and we're going to check my wallet and see if I have any money left. You guys are going to be playing for five American dollars. Legal tender for, and Bowen leaves the room. Now Anna wants to play, but it's too late because she was too shy. And now five, all right. And now who wants to uh, call a game? Anybody want to come in the booth here? Anybody? Nobody, nobody wants to join us in the booth. Uchendu? All right, Uchendu's coming in. I'm just going to hang back and let Jade and Uchendu handle this. Here, you can use that mic there. We got Uchendu from New York City. We have an all New York City booth again. And uh, I'll let you guys pick it up here. It's ball one. And Mark from Stern from uh, Jersey Jack Pinball has just lost his ball. One, two, three. Hey, Uchendu. Yeah, you got to put a blazer on. Uh, now it's official. Now you're a commentator. That's official. Uh, very good. Oh. Return to All right, ball save. Great. Let's see what he's going to go for, though. Okay. Ball control, great. Yeah. And that's a missed lock shot. Oh. Tried to go for a lock shot, missed it. There goes the lock shot. Now he's got all three locks ready to go. Alright, and pick off some orbits. Okay. Make your way Is he going towards for a, uh, total annihilation as well? Bouncing around in the pops up there. Nice ball control. Right now it seems to be whatever shots he can make. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it doesn't seem to be any rhyme or reason. Keeping the ball in play. Always a great strategy. Indeed. Yeah. Great little tip over to save the ball there. And he's going for the saucer, I guess, trying to get that 200 million. Let's see if he survives the saucer. Oh, missed lock shot there. Okay, got a ramp shot. He's got some good progress to TNA uh, to uh, total annihilation right now. That was a good little nudge to get it out of the out lane. Oh yeah, he. As he's saying, you cannot. <laughs> But there we go, ball one locked. And every available man. All right, let's see what okay. he goes for here. He goes for the okay. saucer, gets 200 million. What a better way to start. I feel like that's always a good way to start. Uh, player one only had 100,000 uh, points, so it looks pretty good for him right now. <laughs> Bouncing around a little bit in the flipper. Going back to really? the saucer. Really? I'm just surprised that people are really shooting for the saucer right now. It seems like he I has mean, it dialed in. Yeah, where, it's the, where it's going back to the center. Right. Isn't a lot more skeptical than you are. I'm just back. I'm only on boom control. Okay. <laughs> sure. Yeah. We need the levy boom. We need that. I mean, that's cool. All right, he's uh, slinging out. He survived. Nice sur survives there. And 
once again failing to hit his long shot. But he is making other shots. He's making progress. All right. Okay, there's a second lock. Right there. You, gotta <laughs> you need to say that he's five. missing more often so he can get that shot. <laughs> Talking it up. So one Somebody more for here. multi ball. There There's we go. the multi ball. Nice. Mini boom. 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 <laughs> so this is still ball one, right? Yeah. Sorry, guys. I, I was off. Uh, yeah, know. this is still ball one. So you're looking to get the five jackpots, the flashing red. And then you have the roving su super jackpot to get. It's a reject. Looks like he's gone through his saucer, too. I guess he just wants to get that out of the way in yeah. his multi ball. Yeah, just Absolutely. smart while he's got ball save on and multiple yeah. balls. There's a jackpot. Is he focusing too much on that center? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, see? He, uh, he, he, doesn't it. The he doesn't blow up the saucer. Did he? Oh. He did not blow oh. up the saucer. Oh. And he did only there. got one jackpot in the multiball, so not a very good one. All right, well, let's see if Mark from Jersey Jack Pinball can uh, claw his way back into this one after a fairly poor ball one. Goes for the easy skill shot. Still good for bonus X, oh, though. That's not a great kick out. Uh, or oh, it comes back bit. off the lock shot. Oh, that's so disappointing when you, you get it halfway up there. Going for the saucer as well. It is a copycat lead. <laughs> oh, it gets his locks lit. That's nice. Finally. Oh, no. Oh. All right, well, not a great second ball, but he does have his locks lit, which is going to give him something to work with. And don't forget, uh, Brian had a pretty poor multi ball. So if he can get his multi ball going on ball three, uh, he's going to have something to work with, I think, to try to call his oh, way super back. Super skill shot. Three. Okay. Oh, nice backhand on the fly. And Guess he's got he his Martian attack lit. That's a two ball multi ball there. If he gets all the Martians. Correct, yes. It's a potential two ball multi ball. That's another sauce. Okay, that should be 400, 400 million. Padding is real. Oh, 300 million. Okay. And uh, he's over a billion five. Oh, now. no. Oh, oh, so he took uh, away his bonus, so he's not going to quite make a billion so five. But uh, Mark has some work cut out for him here. Can he, he get the multi ball started? Can he blow up his saucer? Can he claw his way back into a game where he's trailing by 1.3 billion I think, points? I think he just needs to get some shots first. Let's just focus on getting some shots together. I agree. I mean, he's uh, got that multi ball. I would just focus on getting that multi ball. That's, ball that, would be the, that would be the lowest hanging fruit here. Yeah, I mean, the, do not waste time on the saucer. That's that almost. That saucer there. shield is still up, so it's super dangerous. Oh I wouldn't go for that, but there there's the first lock. Okay, two more locks. He has multi ball. Get the troops ready. So he tries to hop this over. He does. He does. And oh, uh, he I don't think he meant to do that, but he did get the saucer I mean, open. I get the saucer open. open. That's okay. Go That's a good it? thing to have uh, for if he's if he gets his multi ball going. Yeah, super indeed. Shot. Oh, I don't know about this. Again, yeah, I don't know. Oh, do not that trust saucer the saucer. Way too much. Who can do? It seems like it would behoove him to get his multi ball going rather than. Uh, uh, I, I believe so. I think that's the easy play right now. Be as long as you make that, that shot. Also. Now, no, he got himself going. into trouble and then bailed himself out. That was a nice series of uh, flipper movements there. All right, hoping to survive the slings here. Trying to get control. Okay. Let's see what he goes for. Back Again, to the saucer. Back to the saucer. All right. Well, he's oh, playing it. We're not. Oh, oh, oh no. Nice oh. Takes a double, double danger. danger. But saves it. Great back save. into the saucer. Well, now the saucer is has no energy left, so he can just. There we <laughs> go. All right. 200,000. 200,000. 300 mil, I believe. Only it's the first one. 200, 200 mil. All right. All right. Going back, back to, to the, the saucer. saucer. Unrepentantly attacking the shield. I just can't get behind the strategy. I don't. <laughs> back right, to I the mean, saucer. Hey, opens he, it he, up. Oh, boy. He's getting results, so maybe I can't oh. really argue with this. I don't know if that was the result he was looking for. Or, you know. I, I would really go for the lock shot right now, trying yeah, to get that multi-ball. Yeah, I mean, he's got two. He's two shots away from multi-ball. Well, I have seen people wail endlessly on that on that spaceship and win. It does happen. And I think we're going to find out if it's going to work. Yeah, uh, but he's about halfway he's now to yeah. Brian's score. Yeah, but Brian, All right, there's okay, lock one two. more lock shot. 
I mean, and Brian stole the play, so he needs to. Eight hundred twenty-five million right now, which is survives Good another ball. saucer shot and in lane. Oh! oh. 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 The saucer oh. given oh. to and Chandu the saucer. and the Take saucer. All right, congratulations to Brian. He's gonna rub it in here a little bit with the last ball. <laughs> Thank you, Chandu. Nice Hey, let's hear it for Uchendu coming into the booth. Nice work. You've won five American dollars. Buy yourself some uh, flipper rubbers for your homebrew. All right. Do we have two more players and maybe someone else who wants to comment? Nobody? All right, then I'm going to play. Uh, those two? All right, let's see it. Let's hear it for Anna Walk. And Lynn, <laughs> yeah. come on down here, and then we'll figure that out. <laughs> hey, does anybody want to join us in the booth for one last game? All right, Brian, Brian, going from boom to booth after winning his five dollars. Thank you so much. Now it's official. All right, let's see what we got. You ladies are playing for ten. American wow. dollars. Can you believe it, ladies and gentlemen? Ten, ten dollars. Ten dollars. Stakes this are higher than ever. The stakes are higher public. than they have been all night. And private. Again with a super skill shot. All right. Oh, and I don't think she capitalized on that. We build an atomic blaster. All right, ramp shot. All right, a good flip away to that ramp. Let's see if you can get control of the ball. Oh, oh no. bad luck. That was a big outing dream right there. All right. It's always, it's, uh, it's always a shame when up. that happens right after your ball saver wears off. Another super skill Going shot. Going for the super oh, skill she, shot. Unfortunately, she's not able to get the it. the saucer. That's all right. We got a lock slit. She got that. Oh. oh. All right. So this is a two ball game right now. I yes, there, is. there is a uh, significant lead over here on the player one. We have a uh, hundred million. Anna Walker commanding ninety million point lead right now. I'm just gonna go out on a limb here and say I'm really anti saucer. I can't. <laughs> well, we saw in that last game. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> oh. However, you need to remember that when when the game is being this mean to our players, that a ninety million can be the difference between winning and losing. And right now, that ninety look million is looking pretty good. Also. It's Attack from Mars. Don't be hating on the saucer. All right, she's trying to... All right, we got control of the ball. Where are we going to go from here? She's going into uh, the swing. Any, there we go. I mean, really, any shots at this point would be helpful given the score. Oh! oh. oh and I, I jinxed. I jinxed All right, this is a one-ball game, ladies and gentlemen. But that one ball is still worth 10 American dollars. So it is more important than any other ball we have had here this evening, ladies and gentlemen. For oh, oh, there okay. we go. Right Struggle back into that scoop. Give Point a little tennis line in the locks. Can we capitalize on that lock? If anyone is able to fill those three locks today, I think that's going to be game over. Oh, oh it goes for the backhand. backhand. That is a bold decision. But with the locks lit, it is possible. Just trying to get to control. Oh, a nice oh, tap nice. in that lock there. Very nice. nice. All right, now let's try to see if he can tip it over. Get a second lock shot right there. Oh, Ooh. that's unfortunate. Little... The tip over is not that friendly. It goes over there, but doesn't really go to the sweet spot. Oh! oh! Was that it's ball right. three? That was ball three. Oh, my goodness. All right. It's all right. Those... over the commanding <laughs> 200 million point lead. Sometimes this happens. Those locks were adding up at 20 million a pop, I believe. Go for the super skill shot. Oh, uh, come on. Oh, all right, no, that, that should come back. back. That, that should come back. Safe. There we she go. Oh, it is. All right, so we're just going to need control of this I ball. Mean, just Does anybody want to win this game? <laughs> we're going to find out. The saucer's nice, looking like nice some suicide touch. right about now, but. I feel like she was maybe going. Oh, that's a there nice we go. shot. Yeah, nice. there we go. Now we're just two shots away from multi-ball, and therefore most likely the game. The yeah, multi-ball would definitely be a guaranteed victory, I would say. She can get that tip over. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's right. Just got to get control of that ball. There we go. A beautiful right cradle. Oh. oh having a little just, late there. Having just played this game, that lock shot is very difficult to find on your first try. Nice 
Yeah, nice like little dead that. bounce. I love that. Is she going to go she for the backhand? backhand. Yeah. No, it's oh, not no. going to go. Nice ramp little ramp pass down there. Down. All right, ramping out. I mean, again, with a points this low, any kind of ramps or any shots are going to Actually, help her a out. left ramp would be incredibly good right here because that would light her hurry up at the saucer and would win the game. Oh, oh, oh wow. the backhand was sweet. Beautiful backhand. So now we have two shots on the left that could result in instant victory. Let's see if we hit any of them. No, unfortunately. Can we get control of the ball? You don't want. All right, Just a little tip any over. Shots, any shots. Oh, no, not the saucer. We, need, we really <laughs> want that left saucer. ramp or that lock Please shot. No. That capture is still worth 20 million points. Oh, and Anna Will again. can see that five or slip it away. Oh, tenner, $10. Ten dollars. Oh. And we have a winner. She chopped wood all the way. Incredible. And there it is in the lock. Oh. lock. A commanding <laughs> victory. All right, she's going to take some victory laps. Well earned. Well earned victory laps. That was a hard-earned multi-ball on a game that is being very hard to our players today. Lindsay doing her celebration of a $10 win right now. I'd be thinking about what I'm going to buy with that $10. She's already been to the dispensary. What's left? <laughs> well, it sounds like snacks are in order. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, she's got a... Wow, that's the end of her multi-ball. But... Uh, you know, really just, just piling it on now. Back, well. back in single ball play. Oh. And the saucer strikes again. Maybe you were All right. Maybe you were right about the saucer. <laughs> look at look at the it sportsmanship on display as they shake hands. Let's hear what it. What a fantastic Adam game by our players, ladies and gentlemen. Let's give it up for them. Congratulations, six hundred million coming from a brown what? Ten Sixty million? American dollars. Ten dollars. Go buy yourself some munchies. Enjoy that. You know what? We're all winners. <laughs> We're all winners tonight. All right. Thank you very thank much, you, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear for Brian in the booth. My name is Ryan. Brian's, Ryan's first time. Awkward. <laughs> Ryan, you're going to have to get hired by uh, Jersey Jack till I get your name right. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> Good work. But on a serious note, pinball streaming, it's a new frontier. And it's one that we've all decided to embark upon. It's one that we've all decided to nurture. Pinball, pinball streaming, it's suckling at the teeth of our enthusiasm. Think about it. It becomes what we put into it. And I think you've seen tonight that we all love pinball, and that's all it takes, ladies and gentlemen. We have a passion, we have a purpose, and I want to thank everybody for joining us tonight in this seminar. I think we've all done good work, and I think you can see that there's a bright future ahead for not only the sport we love, pinball, but streaming, which is going to bring this sport to the world and beyond. So thank you very much for joining us. I appreciate it. And I want to see you all go forth and spread the gospel of pinball streaming. Thank you very much. Enjoy Pintastic. Let's hear it for Dave Marston, helping us put on a great show here. Let's hear it for Chendu in the booth. Let's hear it for Ryan in the booth. Let's hear it for everybody who helped us out tonight. Thank you very much. And I will be here all weekend to answer your questions and bask in your affection. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining us.